हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड वेलकम टू बिट फ्यूम्स एंड वी आर वर्किंग ऑन द नोटिफिकेशन एंड वी हैव डन द मेल नोटिफिकेशन पार्ट एंड इन दिस एपिसोड वी आर गोइंग टू वर्क ऑन डेटाबेस नोटिफिकेशन सो विद दैट आई एम योर होस्ट सार्थक एंड दिस इज अ चैनल वेर आई टॉक अबाउट लेरवल एंड द कूल थिंग अबाउट लेरवल सो इफ यू आर न्यू टू दिस चैनल डोंट फॉर टू सब्सक्राइब एंड लाइक बिट फ्यूम्स ऑन फेसबुक ट्विटर एंड इंस्टाग्राम सो लेट्स वर्क ऑन डेटा बेस नोटिफिकेशन एंड आई एम ऑन लेरवल डॉक्यूमेंटेशन एंड लेट्स गो टू database notification we need a table to store all our notifications so let's run this command to have the migration for that table on our project so open terminal if you are on mac and command prompt for windows user so let's paste it hit enter it will generate migration and where this migration is situated let's open uh, sublime go to database migration and this is the notification table migration that's good and we know that after creating migration we have to migrate so php artisan migrate hit enter and sure enough it will migrate the notification table so if i open my sql pro go to notify table database not table and sure enough we get notifications table so how we will configure our notification for this database notification so if i go to my app folder my notifications folder task completed notification here we have uh, two mail where is that yeah two mail similarly we need a two array function which is already there so we just have to configure this and we don't want to wait for mail purpose so i will just use database not mail if you need you can just give another and this will configure for mail and database both one but to show for tutorial purpose i am just using database for now so here what i am going to do i am going to say yes i want to return some data and that data is this is my first notification that's great so let's see how we can create a notification so for that documentation will help us formatting database so we have formatted the database we have all these things and then um, yeah to accessing the notification firstly we have to save this notification so we already have this if i go to web.php we have yeah this one so if i go to home page it will notify that particular user this is not for particular user uh, uncomment this one yeah so this one is good and i don't want any kind of delay so that's like this yeah it's okay yeah correct so now we don't need this one either yes so everything is good and if i now open chrome Uh, go to uh, start the server. So PHP artisan serve. Okay, and let's now go to localhost eight thousand and ooh, lots of error. Let's see the result. Okay, task completed. Okay, okay. It says that this task complete need a user. so we have not provided any kind of user so why not remove this from here so that we don't need any user or any kind of things here so that's great now go to chrome refresh it and undefined variable user where on the welcome dot blade yes because again in the last episode we have done quite a lot of things and for that it's giving error so let's say here laravel great no great yeah laravel so let's one more try and yes it is here this means if i go to my database and refresh we get two notifications because we have refreshed two times one was getting error that's okay so this is the thing we are getting the id is you can see id is so so good it's uh, i don't know what that but it's uh, good uh, nobody can catch this id okay that's good and 
here is our data so data is here data this is my first notification and these things are very good for this um, simple task and in a just few seconds we have created a notification we have saved the notification and in the next episode we are going to see how we can display this notification and the facebook like thing that uh, uh, there is a bell icon and we will uh, give one to how many notifications are there then the uh, a drop down list where all the notifications can be seen okay so all these things in the next episode so if you have not subscribed please subscribe like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram we will meet in the next episode till then keep learning bye bye